Hey guys, Kim Nonstop here for Shape. Today we're doing a five minute circuit targeting your thighs. You can repeat the circuit for a 10, 15, or even 20 minute calorie busting, butt kicking workout. All you're gonna need for this workout is a towel. This workout involves 30 second rounds. You don't need a timer, just follow me. Okay, we're starting off with jumping jacks. 30 seconds of these just to warm us up. You want your body to be ready for the workout to come. And like I said, it's only a five minute circuit, but you could totally repeat this, and you should repeat this for a 10 or 15 minute circuit training workout. Targeting your thighs. Oh yeah, that's right. Good for short shorts and summer season. Okay, skaters. I call these skaters because they kind of remind me of speed skaters. I don't know. I don't know if there's like an official word for these. So, side to side. Big step to the side, jump, and then jump up to the other side. You're gonna feel your thighs really warming up on this one, which is why we're doing it. Because just wait for what's to come. Big step, jump to the side, swing your arms. Helps you get a little more dynamic in this move. And then we have one more cardio move, and these, I call them scissor lunges. <laughs> um, they're kind of like split lunges, but they're not as intense. You're not going down as low. So keep it quick. Scissor lunges. You really gotta feel your thighs warming up, which is just what we want, because the next move is going to burn. Here we go. This is when you need your towel for this one. So, putting your foot on the towel, slide your leg out, and then slide it back in. Slide your leg out, weight in your heels, slide it back in. Leg out, slide, slide it back in. Slide it out, slide it back in. And you're really gonna feel your inner thighs starting to burn on these, especially as you slide and pull in. Good, and so that's 30 seconds on one leg, now we switch to the other. As you're pulling in, ooh, I got stuck on that one. As you're pulling in, you really wanna squeeze your inner thighs together and think of lifting your head ooh, to the ceiling. Nice tall spine, draw your belly button in, lift and out and lift and out. Ooh, now keep your foot on the towel. We're gonna straight into front lunges. You're gonna slide it back and slide it in. Back and in. These are just front lunges, and yes, feels like it's a staple of every leg workout, but the reason why is because they work. Front lunges are serious. Actually, all lunges. Pretty much, you want your legs to get toned and look amazing, do lunges. And we don't have to count reps because we have that amazing timer. Other leg. So I just switch legs there, switch the towel to the other leg so that I can easily slide it out. Now, important note, if you have a carpeted floor, you can use a plastic bag or a Frisbee on a carpeted floor. And that totally works just as well. And we have one more move standing before we hit the floor. So carpet or a yoga mat. I got my yoga mat ready. Here we go. This last one is plies. Yup, had to do it. One, two, three, and up. Three count plie. Three and up. Legs are out. Wider than hip width apart. Toes pointed at a 45 degree angle. Drawing your belly button in as you go down. Think of elongating your torso. One, two, Three flashbacks to belly clothes. One, two, three. Good. Now we're moving to the floor. Okay, grab a mat or a towel, take it to the floor. We're gonna start off with thigh pulses, lift your hips, squeeze in and out. This is 30 seconds here. And you're really gonna feel these right away, especially after doing the lunges. Your legs are already fired up. And squeeze in and out. If you have a medicine ball, or even can take your towel, roll it up, and squeeze it in between your knees. That's another trick to make this a little harder. And keep squeezing, 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 squeezing. It's only 30 seconds, 
And then remember, you can repeat this circuit. Now we're just going to put the legs out a little further and lift and lower. Now the reason you want your heels further away from your butt is because it targets more of your hamstrings. If you bring your heels in closer, it targets more of your glutes. So keep your legs out a little bit further and really lift and lower and squeeze and you really start to feel this along the backs of your legs, your thighs and your glutes. Remember, we can repeat this entire routine to really make a difference. That's the five minute circuit. Thanks for joining me today. Remember, you can repeat this for a 10, 15, or 20 minute workout. And if you like this workout, be sure to check out my YouTube channel, Kim Nonstop, for more like it. Thanks for visiting me here at Shape.